Hi everyone, Ismail Kolya here, is your realtor from EXP Realty. It is Monday, May 11th of 2020. And I just wanted, just wanted to reach out to you guys and give you a quick update. I hope uh, everyone is doing well and staying safe and staying indoors as much as possible. All right, let's get, let's get started. Uh, so first of all, a happy Mother's Day to everyone. Happy Mother's Day to you and to yours. May God bless all the mothers, not just uh, this week, but throughout the uh, year and every day. Uh, our mothers deserve a, a lot of credit and they are the hero to all the heroes out there. So happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there. All right, let's go ahead and get started. A few changes happening this week. So uh, Governor Cuomo has announced plans uh, for the next part of this uh, New York on pause. Uh, which will be uh, opening up. New York will be opening up in four phases. Uh, phase number one began on May 15th, or will begin rather, will begin rather. Uh, so phase one will begin on May 15th, which is uh, construction, manufacturing, and wholesale supply chain, and select retail stores with curbside pickup. So those businesses will be able to resume business on May 15th. Um, phase two will include professional services, finance and insurance, retail, administrative support, and real estate and rental leasing, which is the industry that I'm in. So we will be able to conduct real estate sales and rentals uh, in phase two. Uh, no date has been given for phase two yet, and that will be dependent on how uh, the corona numbers are looking. So we all need to do our part in terms of maintaining social distance uh, and also health hygiene, hand hygiene, as well as um, just uh, trying not to go outside as much as possible to, to keep the corona spread. Uh, phase three will include restaurants, food services, hotels, accommodations, and then four, phase four will include arts, entertainment, education, and so forth. So be on the lookout for further updates from me as well as from the governor and the state uh, on when those phases uh, will take place. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at a little bit more. Um, so phase one, again, which will begin on May 15th, uh, will include services such as landscaping and gardening, outdoor, low risk recreational services and activities, uh, drive-in movie theaters and construction, as I said earlier. Uh, next thing is the governor has extended the moratorium on, uh, on evictions for uh, residential as well as uh, commercial tenants until August 20th. So no evictions can happen until uh, August 20th, whether you are a residential tenant or commercial tenant. Having said that, I'd like to uh, emphasize that if you are able to pay rent, please pay your rent. Uh, of course, the landlords have their own bills and keep in mind the landlords didn't cause the corona crisis. So the buck can't stop with the landlords. So if you are able to pay your rent, please pay your rent. If you're not able to pay or if you're going through a hardship, have a conversation with the landlord, create a payment plan of some sort and then stick by it. Uh, but that's important to make sure that the landlord isn't left with bills um, that they cannot pay. All right, um, just wanted to give you my information. Uh, my number is 914-215-1540, 914-215-1540. We are conducting virtual showing, so if you are interested in a property, um, I can go there, record a video. I can get on a video call with you and show you the property, uh, and then we can start to explore further options. If you're thinking about selling, we can certainly do a video call as well. Um, while we're waiting for New York on pause to expire. Uh, Ismail Kolya here from EXP Realty. Reach out to me, 914-215-1540. I'd love to talk to you, uh, hear your thoughts on what you think, what's going on uh, in the market, especially with real estate and so forth. If you have any questions about your taxes or uh, your stimulus payment or your 
business loans and so forth. I'm not an accountant. I'm not a professional by any means, but I have been doing some research. So I'll be able to, I'll be happy to answer some questions and then maybe we'll connect you to professionals who may be able to help you further. Please stay safe. Please stay indoors and do your part in minimizing the corona spread. Hoping to connect with you in better times. Thank you so much for watching and I will uh, reconnect with you next week.